Welcome to Positive Atheism English Channel. Today we are in the sixth episode and the last episode of the book What is Religion, written by Robert G. Ingersa. Today I shall continue it from the fifth episode of the book What is Religion. Why should men and women have children that they cannot take care of? Children that are burdens and curses. Why? Because they have more passion than intelligence. more passion than conscience more passion than reason you cannot reform these people with tracts and talk you cannot reform these people with preach and creed passion is and always has been tough these weapons of reform are substantially useless criminals tramps beggars and failures are increasing every day the prisons jails poor houses and asylums are crowded religion is helpless law can punish but it can neither reform criminals nor prevent crime the tide of vice is rising the war that is now being waged against the forces of evil is as hopeless as the battle of the fireflies against the darkness of night there is but one hope ignorance poverty and vice must stop populating the world this cannot be done by moral suasion this cannot be done by talk or example this cannot be done by religion or by law by priest or by hangman this cannot be done by any force physical or moral to accomplish this there is but one way science must make women the owner the mistress of herself science the only possible savior of mankind must put it in the power of women to decide for herself whether she will or will not become a mother This is the solution of the whole question. This frees women. The babes that are then born will be welcome. They will be clasped with glad hands to happy breasts. They will fill homes with light and joy. Men and women who think that light is the enemy of virtue, that purity dwells in darkness, that it is dangerous for human beings to know themselves and the facts in nature that affect their well-being. will be horrified at the thought of making intelligence the master of passion but i look forward at the time when men and women by reason of their knowledge of consequences of the morality born of intelligence will refuse to perpetuate disease and pain will refuse to fill the world with failures when that time comes the prison walls will fall the dungeons will be flooded with light and the shadow of the scaffold will cease to curse the earth poverty and crime will be childless the withered hands of want will not be stretched for arms they will be dust the whole world will be intelligent virtuous and free religion can never reform mankind because religion is slavery it is far better to be free to leave the forts and barricades of fear to stand erect and face the future with a smile it is far better to give yourself sometimes to negligence to drift with wave and tide with the blind force of the world to think and dream to forget the chains and limitations of the breathing life to forget purpose and object to launch in the picture gallery of the brain to feel once more the claps and kisses of the past to bring life's morning back to see again the forms and faces of the dead to paint fair pictures for the coming years to forget all gods their promises and threats to feel within your veins life joy stream and hear the martial music the rhythmic beating of your fearless heart and then to rouse yourself to do all useful things to reach with thought and deed the ideal in your brain to give your fancies wing that they like chemist bees may find arts nectar in the weeds of common things to look with trained and steady eyes for facts to find the subtle threads and join the distant with the now to increase knowledge to take burdens from the weak to develop the brain to defend the right to make a palace for the soul and this is the real religion so the religion can never reform mankind because it is always slavery and so as i said it is far better to be free to stand erect and face the future with a bright smile and with this robert g ingersoll ended the book what is religion and we'll meet again in another episode thank you
for more videos please subscribe to this channel positive atheism and activate the bell icon